Hi, my name is Nika. Hi guys, this is Christina. And welcome, welcome to, to Discover Later Trends. So we're here right now at Matalong and we have now our media IDs, right Tina? Legit man! <laughs> so yeah, there's a lot of people already here and um, we're just waiting for our boat. Yeah, you can feel the excitement, mm -hmm. people are ready to party! It's still 9 I guess, Yeah. so 9 30 ish. We'll get to the island at around um, 10? Yes, so 10, yeah. So. We'll see you guys there! Let's get our party on! Bye! <laughs> I'm here with one of the party goers for the Canigo Music Fest. Who is JV Nunez. Taga sa ka sir? Taga bye bye Taga bye bye. So, where are you about the Canigo Music Fest? Na mama na kita mo ko sa Facebook na ikuan ba? Katong mura si ticket niya rin. Unya, sir ka lang. First time mo ito kanigaw? Dili. Pero first na ako karoon nga mura beach party ba? Ah, okay. So, kung sa may mo, i-expect na ito sir. Sa may mo, gusto mga hitabo din ito. Lingaw, niya. Ito na ako. Party good. Party, party. So, sir JD, magkita ito nga ito niya sa isla ha? Party na, party na kay. I'm here again with another party goer for Canigo Music Festival, sir. Say it, man, sir. Okay. And... Free time. Richie. Taga asa mo, ma'am, sir? Armo. Taga armo. So, excited na mo para unya? Yes. Okay. Sige, so asa mo muna kayo ba about sa Canigo Music Fest? Through... Facebook. Facebook. Okay. See you later. Woo! 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 Okay. <laughs> Woo. So, Hi. we're here. This is our featured co-host for this episode. Guys, meet Randall, aka Mr. Abs. Hi, I'm Angela. <laughs> so, yeah. So, they will be um, going with us in Canigo Music Festival in a bit. And they will be the one who's going to tour around and ask some questions for our <laughs> So, diyami karon sa boat and nakasakay na mong usas sa mga alduha sa mga organizer dito sa Kanigo Music Fest. Um, this is Jason and Leo. Leo. So yeah, so unsa man sir, kung unsa naman kuan karon today as of 10:17, unsa naman situation karon? Um, very stressful. <laughs> Um, busy, 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 Uh, accommodate pa mo og napay napay mga So expected na to na tawon na naa karon sir pila siguro no 1500 that's a lot of him So kung sa may mga fun parts nga mo i-expect unya sa event This one Unsa man siya sticks and stones Oh DJ So DJ oh hi Amo nga set ka Alam mo to Eleven to twelve. Um. Set. Pino sir? I am twenty. Mau bata mga bata pa gud niyo organizers? Ikaw Angela pala yung Nineteen. Na kaya Single mo, single ka? Okay. So thank you so much, um, Jason and Leo, and we will be seeing. Them, Angela, no. Oh. Samo takay single. <laughs> Pangit pangitaon jud na ko sila. <laughs> After party. Yay! Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Sabot na. <laughs> so, sige, thank you. So, yeah, thank you. Bye. Thank you. Bye. <laughs> Here now at the island of Canigo! 
I'm from my bar, then I moved to uh, Seattle, Washington. Are you single? Yeah. I'm single. I have a question for you. If you were stranded in an island, who would you want to ask? Hi. Probably Rihanna. Why? Why are you asking? I know she's beautiful. She's gorgeous. I'll probably marry her. Yeah, for sure. Party. Yeah, that's good. Woo! So, some expectation na rin karong gabi sa party. Ah, ay, 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 ay,
think Canigo, I'm, I'll start with Canigo Island itself. Um, for me, the island itself is not equipped like for the comfort room, for the restrooms. Like they, they knew that there will be 1,500 people coming only for that event, not including those people who are already in the island. So they should have just put this um, portable comfort rooms for, for the event itself. event itself. So yes, and for the party, um, it was okay. Um, it was good, though I do have a bit of um, like few points for the DJ like the people are already pumped up and then they'll just cut it off something like that so but um, not all of the DJs because I think they have around six DJs who are participating on this set event so um, maybe just few of them <laughs> how about you Tina okay so um, it's my, it was my first time in Canigo um, basically Nika is right uh, there should be a room. I mean, there should be improvements with the facilities, particularly the CR, because um, not just because of the event. You know that it's a tourist spot, so that's your obligation to uh, to uh, supply your tourists with uh, pot potable water or yeah. uh, clean CRs. And right. but basically, there's still room for improvement, so they can do it. And also, uh, I also noticed a huge uh, garbage issue in the island. You can see bottles even underwater so that has to be addressed now uh, they do have signs that said uh bring your uh basura mo dalamo something like that so i that's good but they should be strict on implementation but they should uh when people board the banka they should ask for the garbage bags like um they should also provide garbage bags to the visitors going there so that's just a suggestion um for the music fest since I have big expectations since it wasn't my first. Um, for first timers, it was pretty okay. Yeah. I mean, I could give them a thumbs up for that, for effort. Um, uh, the stage could have been, I mean, the space could have been utilized better. Uh, like Nika said, the DJs should, um, they should work out a way to uh, change sets without stopping yeah. the music altogether. Because people were like, woo, -hoo! and then switch DJ. Down. So good two minutes. The momentum was <laughs> dead. The momentum yeah. was dead. But you know what? It was it was great. We had fun. Yeah. People had fun. Um, hopefully there'll be more music fest. Hopefully Kaniga will be granted a second year. I mean yeah. Kaniga Music Fest will be granted a second year. Okay. So you're right, Tina. So um, this is the first music festival festival here in Kaniga. Yeah. So a lot of people all around Leyte is really ecstatic about the said event. Like there's a lot of people nearby towns and cities like Tacloban, um, or Mo, or Mo, bye bye, bye, bye. So good. Mm -hmm. Even in Manila and Cebu, we yeah, interviewed we have... few people or few groups that are from the said um, city. So yeah, I even I even talked to someone from Bohol. Yeah. So yeah, it was pretty awesome. Um, like the yeah. turnout was awesome. Yes. Yeah. So kudos to. The organizer and Tina, me, and the rest of the team, Discover Lady Society, Discover Lady Trends, would like to thank especially Ivan, who, who um, Ivan and Jason, who coordinated with us and invited us on this spectacular event that they did. Yeah, yes, thank Tina. you for accommodating us. Thank you for answering our yeah. <laughs> endless questions. Uh -huh. and thank you for giving us the opportunity to be able to showcase your event. Mm -hmm. So hopefully. Next year will be a bigger and better Kaniga Music Fest 2018. Yep, so far so good. Yes. Right? <laughs> so for uh, for the for our pilot episode, this has been a great episode. So hopefully you guys tune in for our next show. This has been Christina. This is Nita. And, and thank you for joining us at Discovery Trends. Trends. <laughs>